following movie will create a linear static analysis of a link in a managed environment under Team Center. We'll begin by entering the pre-post application and we'll create our simulation files. Select the revision. For our FEM, can optionally create an idealized part. You can select what bodies we'd like to use. And for our solver environment, we'll select SimCenter and Astrian and Structural. Next, we'll specify a revision by double-clicking for the next revision for our sim as well. And then we'll create a linear static solution. Now, if we had any small features that we'd like to remove, like small blends, uh, we could do that in the idealized part by first promoting and then idealizing. But since we don't, we'll go straight to our FEM and we'll create a 3D tetrahedral mesh on the link. We'll use the lightning bolt in the element size to estimate a size for our mesh. You can adjust some of the mesh settings such as the surface curvature based size variation and we can also select auto fix failed elements all right but we'll take the rest of the defaults now that we have our mesh we'll assign a material to the mesh collector We'll select aluminum out of the library. All right, now we'll go to the sim, which is where we'll specify our constraints and our loads. We'll create a fixed translation, translation constraint on the ID surface of the link on the left. And we'll select uh, force or a load to put on the ID surface on the link on the right. All right, at this point we're ready to solve. Right click on the solution, select solve. And the solution monitor in the bottom right, you can see uh, real time it's two seconds for this model to solve. Now, before we take a look at our results, we'll go ahead and save. And this will save our idealized part, fem, and sim, and give us an option to import our results files. And the one that we want is the OP2. That one has our solution results in it. We'll go ahead and open those now that we've saved. So here you can see our displacement and stress results as well. And if we'd like, we can also write out these results to a JT. And here we can select exactly what type of results we'd like. We'll select displacement and stress. We'll say add to list and managed for our save option. All right, and at that point, we're ready to look at those results in the rich client. And that concludes the demonstration.